Yo, yo, what is up? So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to bring in models from Blender to Unreal Engine. And uh, yeah, should be easy, should be quick. So let's hop into it. All right, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to select everything, uh, everything a part of our model in Blender. You do this by pressing A. Um, sometimes that'll select all this other stuff too, like the light and the camera and stuff. So I tend to just, uh, you know, just highlight it all. And then we're going to go up here to File, Export, FBX right here. And what you want to do here is I'm going to find a folder to throw this in. I'm just going to throw it in my Blender Models folder. I'm going to name this Rustic Longsword. Name it what you want to name it. And we're going to limit this to Selected Objects. And I'm just going to do a Mesh. So just highlight Mesh right here. And then you want to come down here. We're going to change the axis right here. We're going to change this from negative Z forward and Y up to Y forward Z up. And then we're going to come down to geometry and we're going to change the smoothing right here to face. And if you have any uh, modifiers that aren't applied yet, you can go ahead and apply them. Typically, this is uh, checked by default. So I tend to not mess with that. Uh, I'm going to uncheck add leaf bones on armature. It doesn't matter. We don't have it don't have any bones on this so and I'm also gonna uncheck a bake animations and then we're just gonna uh we're just gonna export this so export that then we're gonna hop over to Unreal Engine so in Unreal Engine we're just gonna find our file let me just find that guy real quick right here here it is right here we're just gonna pull this guy in and for this, I'm just going to leave all the uh, default settings. If, you, uh, if you're if you bringing in a model that has multiple pieces to it, you can merge them here. Combine meshes. You can combine meshes, and that'll uh, import it combined. But I'll show you another way that you can combine meshes as well. So we're just going to import all right here. And then I'm just going to pull this guy in here into the level and just real quick uh yeah you see that works works fine uh just real quick i'm gonna make a material and then we're gonna combine this mesh so i'm just gonna make a material m underscore sword and i'm gonna open this guy and i'm gonna bring in my textures for this guy i'm just gonna bring in all these textures Import all those. Bring in these textures. So we can add it onto the material. Uh, this is an ARH. So this is going to be ambient occlusion, roughness. Got our normal right here. And this is an MSE, so metallic specular and apply and save I'm just gonna make that a material instance real quick and I'm gonna find my material here and I'm just gonna throw this material on that but yeah like I said I'm gonna show you a way of combining these meshes right now these are all separate so if you have a mesh like that that you have brought in you can uh, just select them all, select all the pieces, pieces, come up here to Actor, and you're going to come down to Merge Actor, and we're going to go to Merge Actor Settings. And something you could do in here is to, you can choose to replace Source Actor. So what that means is uh, it'll replace the, uh, the model in your scene with the merged version that we're uh, making right now. So once you hit Merge Actor, you're just going to find your... Uh, where you want to bring it in at, I just brought it in to the third person folder. I made a folder called models and I'm just going to pull it in here and rename it to uh, longsword. And now if we click on this guy, you see it's now just one mesh with all the, uh, all the parts together. And uh, yeah. And that's all there is to it so we're gonna call it here for this one if you like the video hit the like button if you're new around here definitely subscribe 
If you have any questions, let me know those down in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.